Canada's tank system often flies under the radar, but behind the calm reputation of the Canadian Armed Forces is a fleet of modernized armored vehicles built for power, precision, and survivability in some of the toughest environments on Earth. As global tensions rise and military modernization accelerates, Canada has begun reshaping its armored capabilities to ensure it remains ready for the future battlefield. Today, we'll explore how Canada's tank fleet evolved, what systems remain in service today, and how these tanks are being upgraded to meet 21st century threats. Canada's tank history has always been tied to the country's international commitments. For decades, it relied on lighter mobile vehicles like the Leopard C-1. Today, the backbone of Canada's armored power is the Leopard. To families specifically, the Leopard 2A4 M can and the Leopard 2A6 M can, these tanks combine German engineering with Canadian specific enhancements, creating some of the most resilient battlefield vehicles used by any NATO member. The Leopard 2 A6 M can stands as Canada's most advanced tank. It features a long barrel Rhine metal 120mm L55 smoothbore gun, giving it improved accuracy and penetration over earlier models. The M in its name refers to mine protection, and this is where Canada invested heavily. The A6M can include reinforced belly armor, blast-resistant seating, and a redesigned escape hatch focused on protecting crews from the most common threats encountered during modern combat operations. Canadian engineers also integrated enhanced cooling systems, recognizing that the tank often operates in extremely hot climates during overseas. Missions conditions far different from Canadian winters. The result was a tank optimized for long missions, both in the desert and in the North Atlantic's harsh training ranges. The Leopard 2A4M can serve alongside it, forming the backbone of Canadian armored training and reserve operations. While the A4 variant has a shorter L44 gun, it remains a potent firepower platform. Canada's A4M upgrades focused on survivability, situational awareness, and crew protection. With ADON armor modules, thermal imaging systems, digital fire control upgrades, and reinforced hull structures. The A4M can is far from outdated. It may be older in design, but it's been built to meet Canada's present needs. But Canada S Tank Power, ISNT, just about the tanks themselves, S also about the supporting systems. The Canadian Army utilizes a layered network that includes armored engineering vehicles, armored recovery vehicles, tactical drones, battlefield sensors, and digitally networked command systems. Together, these tools create what modern militaries call an integrated armored ecosystem, where tanks work hand-in-hand -hand with infantry, drones, reconnaissance units, and artillery. One major development has been the increasing use of drones to support tank operations. Canada has invested in surveillance UAVs capable of identifying threats before armored units ever come close. This improves battlefield awareness while reducing risk. In addition, tactical data link systems allow tank commanders to receive real-time maps, enemy positions, and mission updates directly inside the vehicle. Canada's modernization doesn't stop with sensors and software. There's an ongoing push to upgrade the Leopard fleet further. Canada is evaluating future armor kits, improved thermal imaging systems, active protection systems, and advanced munitions. Active protection systems are especially important because they represent the next evolution of tank defense. Instead of relying solely on thick armor, active systems can detect incoming rockets or missiles and intercept them before impact. This technology is already being used in some NATO countries, and Canada is exploring how to integrate similar systems into its Leopard 2 fleet. Another major focus is mobility. Canada's vast geography ranges from Arctic tundra to dense forests to open plains. Tanks must be able to operate effectively in all of these environments. That's why future upgrades will likely prioritize improved engines, adaptive suspension systems, and optimize tracks that work better in snow, mud, and ice. Some of these mobility upgrades will also ensure that tanks can remain operational during extreme cold, something few countries need to consider but is essential for Canadian operations. Canada is also participating in discussions about next-generation NATO tanks. Several NATO allies are developing concepts for future armored vehicles that incorporate hybrid engines, advanced AI-driven targeting systems, and modular armor that can be swapped depending on mission type. While Canada has not formally committed to replacing the Leopard 2 yet, 
it's keeping a close eye on development to ensure its forces do not fall behind. Beyond the technology, one of the key strengths of Canada's tank system is its personnel. Canadian tank crews receive extensive training through programs that emphasize precision, discipline, and teamwork. Whether navigating rugged Canadian landscapes or participating in NATO exercises in Europe, Canadian tank crews consistently demonstrate high levels of professionalism and skill. Many allied nations recognize Canada's ability to adapt, maintain, and operate complex armored systems with impressive effectiveness. Canada also prioritizes interoperability with allies. Since tank deployments often happen alongside NATO partners, it's essential that Canadian tanks can communicate, maneuver, and operate seamlessly with forces from the US, Germany, Poland, and others. This has influenced how Canada upgrades its Leopard fleet, ensuring compatibility with standard NATO ammunition, fueling systems, and battlefield communication networks. So what does the future of Canada's tank system look like? While Canada is not aiming to build the biggest tank fleet in the world, it is committed to maintaining a highly capable, modern, and flexible armored force. Upgrades will continue, especially in the areas of protection, sensors, and digital integration. Expect more focus on Arctic mobility, drone coordination, AI-enhanced decision-making tools, and active defense systems. Canada's tanks symbolize more than firepower. They represent a strategic commitment to protecting the nation at home, supporting international missions abroad, and working with allies to maintain global stability. From Afghanistan to NATO training grounds to future Arctic missions, Canada's tank fleet will continue to evolve. As the defense world changes rapidly, Canada's armored power shows that even a moderate-sized military can wield highly effective modern tank systems that punch far above their weight through smart upgrades, strategic partnerships, and continuous modernization. Canada's tank capability stands strong, ready for whatever challenges lie ahead.